Well, howdy folks, I'm Max Stevens, I buy old records, and I'm back here at my old friend Half Price Bookstore, just the main one. Hadn't been here in a while, so I thought, let's go hit it. Hey. Right. Mm -hmm. Off to a lackluster start. Cool looking label. Old Buddy Holly. Unplayable. It's some fun, huh? Yeah. A lot of newer stuff here. It's not good. Looking for the pockets of the older stuff. Please don't tell me you like Garth Brooks. Well, it looks like they've added a lot, a lot of junk. Oh, great fiery balls. There we go. That's Rockabilly. And look at that. Joey D singing about a hair tonic. Okay, maybe I found the good stuff. label but not always so I found one decent one so far I think okay all the older stuff is to the front apparently yeah very good Hey, look at there. Bird dog. Huh. Very cool sound alike label. Did I already look through this one? Yeah, I did. 
whole lot of dance studio and square dance. Say it with me, the bane of my existence. You know. Oh yeah. Yeah, you do. Okay, I've already been through those. Now I'm starting to repeat myself repetitively in a redundant manner. It repeats. Or something. Okay, a quiet area. I don't like the quiet area. I want some excitement. Alright. United States Air Force Band. No. Wait, wait, wait. Mm. Maybe. I'll have to give that some thought with thinking. Charlie Rich again. That's always fun. But I've got copies of those. Lots and lots. I started getting rid of stuff. So if anybody ever wants to come out and see me and buy, I don't know, thousands at once, I'll make you a very, very cheap price. And there'll be good stuff, terrible stuff, stuff in the middle. Think about it anyway, that's all I ask. Come out and make me an offer. The worst thing that could happen, I could just hate you for the rest of your life. I'll call you bad names on the video blog. That's the worst. So that's not so bad. Oh, there we go. Saccharine Sally. There's a rocker. A good one, too. So I found a couple of rockabilly things. The Lynn record on the green label. This one here. That's from out of uh, Gainesville, Texas. Joe Leonard recorded that. one of the local Dow studios probably but it's a good rocker I like it what is this I don't know what this is I think it's modern I don't know pop a do down look like something from the 80s maybe but I'll look it up maybe it's something of interest <laughs> there it is the most common record I ever find just about drawn cheap by Bill Justice my buddy Mark Lee Allen always says there's a record or two when he sees it in a pile, he'll just stop. And I can't remember what his is, but it's something dead common. When he sees it, he knows that's a sign from the record gods just to stop. Maybe I should do that too. Ooh, good looking uh, label there, but it is Slim Whitman. So gosh darn popular in Europe, according to Pee Wee Herman anyway. Ooh, Mil Besos, Eduardo Fuentes. I don't know that all star and it's by Hispanic group. And I've got no idea what that is. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's not good, but I'm gonna get it anyway. Just in case I'm wrong. I need a good one right now. Let's see. Oh, Charlie Rich again, that's a label variation. I got multiple copies of that at the house that I can't sell so there you go a little 33 uh, little Jimmy Dickens that was out for a very short time in the early 50s and then dropped like a hot potato that 7 inch 33 you just didn't have the fidelity they were thicker in hell those records were so I guess it took a whole lot more to press out one I don't know what that is. Looks good. I just held a copy of that in my hand. Ooh, that's horrible scratch. Nothing I can do with that. Tony Perkins speaks. Lou Monty speaks. Oh, good. I'm glad we can talk. All right. Well, I got me a snack. Thanks to my angel bringing it to me. And I've got me a couple of good rockabilly records. David Gates and the Two Tones doing Saccharin Sally. And some other stuff of interest. Got to see what Joey D says about hair cream. 
so we'll catch you guys later this is a nice short but productive session <laughs>